Today I'm headed to game stores and search for items to flip for profit to build the Pokemon collection of my dreams. And in this one I get followed to my car by an employee and get behind the counter at a game store for some deals I never expected. Alright, so we're at the game store trying to find some, some items maybe that we can start to grow a Pokebank to maybe find a Pokemon item later to add to the collection and we're with Seth. How's it going? So you're looking for like N64 and stuff oh, like anything. that. Yeah, I need to be careful about not spending too much money. There's a lot of stuff here, a lot of games. So you got Retro right here with Sega, Atari, and then NES, SNES, N64. I'm thinking there might be some good deals in some of the accessories. So we might start there and hopefully we can find some, some targeted items you know, later in the day or maybe just kind of grow the Pokebank and, and find some good profitable flips. May I ask what the goal is for the Pokebank currently? Can we go back for the Charizard? I feel like we got to start building back up to it. First edition Charizard. That's crazy. I'm yeah, stoked. It's it's blue. The road to five grand. Let's do it. I mean, are you getting it? If you're not getting it, I'll get it. If you're getting it, then no, I'm not getting it. Oh, then I'll get it. First I want you it. to get this. Yeah, of course I'm gonna get this. this. Are you really not getting it? No, you're, just, you're not just helping me out. You're uh, like, I, I am helping you out <laughs> because you must play this. I it's love a this great game. game. <laughs> I have played it. It is good. Okay. Okay, I'll get this. I'm, and I'm gonna be getting this though. Twelve ninety nine. Oh, sweet. Little Vita game. But as I'm looking around, I want to welcome you, ninety eight thousand subscribers, and the sixty six percent of you that aren't subscribed. We're almost at one hundred k, and I have a big special plan for when we hit it, but I have a challenge for you. Recently, our home football team, the Detroit Lions, commented on one of our videos. If we can get more subscribers than their YouTube channel before the 100K special video comes out, I'll do one of the biggest giveaways that I've ever done for you guys. And quick side note, we're filming this the day that the Lions are playing the Chiefs, and I'm assuming that they broke our hearts, so please help us out and subscribe. We got some games. It is a distinct smell in there. <laughs> I got N64 for 60 bucks. Straight up console. Controller pack for five. GameCube microphone for five. Dreamcast VMU for five. There's some profit to be had. We probably yeah. we probably got about, honestly, like 100 bucks profit right there. And That's I only great. spent 93. Not bad. It's pretty good. And Seth got a yeah. couple things. Oh yeah, we got a recommended from Chase. We got Street 2. Let's go. Good Such one. a fun game, man. And complete. Well, yeah, complete yeah. actually, yeah. Great. And then we also got a game which I, I thought I had, but I guess I don't. Uh, Donkey Kong Country, classic. Those are two great games. And you got the GameCube mic, but. I did, yep, but you got it. It was free, me. it was my five, get six free. I had I five, I should throw that on mine. You so. could have, oh, you could have had the profit of the series. That's <laughs> <laughs> all right. And then we went to a Goodwill. And there was nothing, but we went to a game store and we got lucky. How's it going? Doing good. Chase, I thought I was gonna meet you one of these days. Let's go. What's your name? Guy. Lou, nice to meet you. You too. How you doing? So I was gonna ask, you. are you guys cool if we record and stuff? I and have no problem with that. Okay. I've cool. been waiting for this moment. I watch, I've been watching you guys for years now. I'm like, it's hey, <laughs> fantastic. Days, one of these days, I'm gonna see them come in here. <laughs> it's been a while since we've been here. Yeah, I know it has. Yeah. We're here. Hold on one second. My boss was just in here. I want to make sure and verify with him. Oh yeah, for sure. If there's something you don't want to record, guys, told you one day. Hi. Oh, yes, that's right. <laughs> it's a clean box. Actraiser two. Buy it. Wait, you have, didn't we just get that? Oh, we got the first one. Oh. Yeah. This is some clean boxes. Look at the DuckTales 2 for six. That must not have the manual or something. All right, well, we're going to have to look at a lot of that. <laughs> yeah, we definitely need to look at a lot of that. I agree. Streets of Rage 3. They got Saturn Bomberman. There's Streets a lot of, of heavies. Yeah. It's a nice case. They? Silent Hill 2. Oh, don't forget Space Jam. Can we get that just for the meme? I've never heard of that. Oh, yeah. it's got Charles Barkley in it. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Thank you. Whatever you want to look at. Yeah. Heck yeah. Cool. What are you trying to see in here? So, these two up front, the Chrono Trigger and the Act Razor 2, and probably DuckTales 2. Chrono. This is the uh, the Graham edition. I didn't want to oh, find the box. I'm sure you guys <laughs> forgot to get that off of there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's... I didn't want to discolor it at all. And then Act Razor 2, maybe. Yeah. Just to look at. See how complete this guy is. Best of my abilities, I don't think it's missing anything. Do you happen to have a loose copy? I haven't looked quite. I do over here, it is in kind of nasty shape. Oh, so dang it. The label's kind of okay. seen better days, but. Oh, it's got the maps, too. I'm pretty, I think it's just missing like missing the, one. Uh, oh. uh, like the Nintendo card, the that's certified card, whatever. This yeah. Is I think that's the main thing that's missing out of it. 
I just found a in unbelievably clean box and everything it didn't have the game in it at a, gr a garage sale video will come out next week yeah but <laughs> I had to pay I had to pay up but like I was like I just got to find a beautiful cartridge so it's unfortunate the one over there isn't beautiful I, I don't really need a, another complete one you know <laughs> so well I mean buy it and then there's somebody who'll want that I see what you're saying well it's also 700 bucks and we have yeah. other stuff right now <laughs> So seven hundred bucks. You guys doing a Pokemon Pursuit video? Or? Yeah, actually. Yes. We don't got any cards in here. I'm sure you guys have already stopped at Rocket. <laughs> no, we're going there. We're going there in a, in a bit. Yep. I talk. The guy comes in here all the time. He's like, man, I'm going through stacks of Spawn comps. I'm like, yeah, I mean, I feel you. Yeah. I'm going through stacks of PS2 games since earlier today. <laughs> right. <laughs> uh, there's some Pokemon stuff over here. Pokemon stuff. Yes, look at oh. this, baby. The Pokemon Pikachu Tamagotchi thing. I've seen thing. that. That's cool. I think we just, I, I kind of want it. I like that. <laughs> and we do have, we did get 100 in profit earlier. Yes. But there's also so first print red and blue. Those are clean. We spend. It might not be first print. Could be, could be second print. Well, we'd print. have to look on the back to confirm. Yep. But 400 and 350 is definitely on the high end. Now we do have Pokemon Blue complete now. Yeah, but it's kind of the box is yes. like, kind of so, rough. Depending on this one, could be a condition upgrade. Uh, uh, I think it would be, but we can't afford it right now. No. To I mean, we can make some progress. We can buy. Let's send Phoenix Resale a picture and see if he'll see if he'll, he'll buy get it a from thousand us. Bucks for that. Yeah. Let's see if he'll buy it for like maybe even 500. We'll cut him a deal. That's a good idea. Okay. We gotta hook him up. Yeah. <laughs> so, what are you looking for currently? I'm kind of looking for complete stuff, good condition. We need to grow the, the Pokebank a little bit. So, I found one 3DS game. We got Rayman 3D over here. Good price, 15 bucks complete. Um, so, I'm digging this one. Any other like accessories you're looking at? Yeah, like VMUs, a lot of times you can find those at game stores. Like I bought one earlier today for $4.99. Those are priced more around what they're worth. Mm -hmm. um, maybe they'll work with us on some stuff, maybe? Maybe, like I, I don't know. We just met the manager, but he's gone now, Super so. Super nice. Yeah, I mean, they got a lot of stuff, but I feel like maybe PS2 we could find some good stuff. Mm -hmm. I don't know. GameCube over here. I see that every day. That's a clean one, too. Yeah. Disney Sports basketball, for those that don't know, in this condition would probably go for like $1,000. Yes. Uh, soccer is not the same story, but I'm still intrigued. I'm gonna look that one up. Amazing Island, maybe two. We could have something in here, we'll see. All right, so this is the exact type of game I was mentioning, like complete, popular title, goes very good on Amazon. Let's see if there's a value disparity. You only got it for 10 bucks. So buy box is twenty nine ninety nine. So you're trying to find the lowest very good, correct? I'm trying to find the lowest very good with a description. So it looks like twenty three ninety nine. Still no descriptions though. Twenty nine fifty realistic first prime very good. Wow. Which would mean we would get about eighteen bucks after fees. So that's eight in profit. So we're gonna take that. Cool. All right. So Chase is going through kind of scanning a bunch of the sealed yes. stuff. So I actually found a couple that are good. Um, <gasps> country dance. So 15 bucks in this one, it'll go for 25. And then. But country dance. Country dance, all time great. Get 20 for that. They're just a little bit, just because they go for a little more on Amazon. So, trying to grow that Poke Bank here. And then it, these are like they would be good at 30, but they're not more, packaged for individual sale. Together, and they have ripped seal. Bag. All right. Yeah. And then he's bringing out some boxes and maybe some manuals Empties. for us to look at. Ooh, what's a Mega Man and Star Fox? Player's Choice. Oh, there's some sell. handheld boxes. Yeah. Whoa. Mm. Oh, you just got that one complete, right? Nope. No? Nope. I got. I think I got a electric, the see-through blue? Maybe. Maybe not. I don't know. I like boxes, though. <laughs> That's, and we also have the Zumba Fitness box, so. Oh, yes. Oh, I see Ogre Battle. That's a big box. Some and Star are, Soldier. Some of them a little banged up. Ogre battle's nice. Perfect though. Gar gargoyles. Gargoyles. Some breath of fire. Breath of fire. Shoot. I got a little bit more. You guys got some Pokemon manuals underneath this. Oh man. snap. Uh, oh sapphire, ruby. Nice. Gold, silver, I'm not silver. Even done yet. He's still <laughs> grabbing more. Gall. Classics. Well, Chase. I mean, 
We have the ability to A lot of these boxes piece we just got out. without the manuals. Lego? Lego racers? Golden oh, eye. cases. Oh, I know I got the Mario 64 without it and the Golden Eye from that recent buy. Pokemon Channel. You got DS, Soul Silver, Pearl. Holy crap. There it is. You scared my game. <laughs> That's you. <laughs> That's you. <laughs> you know what kind of price? Um, I mean, I don't know if you. Mm -hmm. So I mean, you could shoot me a number. Mm-hmm. And I mean, I'll just go from there because like these are just all sitting back there. Yeah. The only one that's sad is like she has this one. Mm-hmm. I, I have that DS. It's my everyday DS. Oh yeah. Box like way back oh. in the day when we moved. That's a nice one. So, yeah. I, mean, I know how you guys do business. You want to shoot me a number? Worst I could say is no or okay. It, so. Yeah, I'll do a little bit of quick research here. These are all empty boxes or manuals, which they've had kind of just sitting in the back. I asked if they had stuff in the back. Good stuff. And Lou brought it out for us. Um, you got Bloodlines. You've got like these are just all nice boxes. This is one that I could really use. Um, still don't have the console yet, but the box is usually the harder part. And then. You got some Pokemon Ogre Battle, it's catching my eye, the Star Soldier. Uh, terrible condition, but it does have the manual, and we might actually be able to... What's that thing we got? The press? Yes. We could we try have not it out. Tried. We bought that three months ago. I know. We should try that <laughs> with that, because it feels like a prime Yes, that's a good contender. candidate. We'd have to practice on something a lot so, cheaper so than this. So it's a it's a heat press that a people heat press. recommended. You, there's uh, a, Sit Cooper. Yes. So there's so there's a safe like it, thing yep. you can put over top of the box and then you just press it and it makes it yeah, nice. Yeah, it's just like nice parchment paper or something. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. So and then there's like a couple more console box. Breath of Fire. Like yeah. Just, Breath of Fire is a good one. I mean, this one has some wear too, but that's that a, could be a, that's press a good one. box. Yeah. Like has potential. It's got a good manual. I'll throw that on. There's some good ones over here Zumba too, Fitness. but that's just a classic. Yeah. We can probably I'm kidding. You ignored that completely. I'm sorry. <laughs> What'd you say? <laughs> I was just gonna add in Zumba Fitness. No, I'm good. Thanks. Thanks. We didn't. We don't have enough. <laughs> uh, we also got the, the active over there with the 360. With the oh <laughs> snap! <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I kind of got these three stacks. Now I don't know if this one is on the table or not. I mean, everything is. Okay. As long as if I didn't want to sell it, I wouldn't have brought it out. Okay. So there's, there's some good ones. The best ones being probably Ogre Battle and Star Soldier. And then the other ones are solid, but nothing. I guess Bloodlines is a pretty big one, too. I mean, if it was a nice condition. Yeah, like obviously that, that makes a difference. Top, I heard you guys got the press thing and tried to. Yeah, so hopefully thing. it's a big old, yeah, like heat press with, I don't even know how it works, but I got some cheapy, cheapy boxes like this okay. that we're gonna. This will be the reason to finally actually give it a shot. Um, what were you thinking? I'm thinking like, if you're around like 250, you good with that? That's not, I mean, we're just, they're sitting on the shelf. I mean, I know adding the games to it, but I'm sure you have some of these games. So. I, I'm hoping so, <laughs> but, I'm yeah, <laughs> yeah, I haven't so seen any of them out there. I'm doing a giant puzzle, like I like finding all the stuff. Right. Like, the only thing I actually had was Perfect Dark over there, but okay. no one's going to find that in the box. So, yeah. You good with that? Yeah. Sick. Well, thank you. No, no problem. Much appreciated. Do you want to just do that, or still, I know you had um, I got a few games here. The Rayman 3D, the Rayman yeah. 3D plus these, and then I don't know if these stacks are for yep, sale all this or. stuff is. We just been trying to get it resurfaced, so some of okay. these have been resurfaced already. Yep. Nothing. Yeah. Nothing really is. Dark Cloud. There's, a, there's a couple of decent. Yeah, Dark Cloud Two. Oh yeah, you got the it's Shadow. Anders. Yeah, what are those? Those top three PS2. Oh, Armored Core, Shadow, and Dark Cloud. Yeah, they're all kind of good. Armored Core 3, 60, 75, Shadow Hearts Covenant. Okay, so that's only 20 bucks. There it is. There it is. It's a sleeper. <laughs> yeah, I don't think I need any of these. I'm looking at these other stacks just to make sure. Do we have a cartridge of this? I don't think so. Okay. We, we always, always get these. Those. That's the thing. We always get these in. Same with even Pokemon Y. Let's like, see if they one have of those them might before. Even be an upgrade. Like I don't know. Yeah, they don't have any of these cards. I just want to make sure, in case they had them. I don't really need Y. Sneaky snakes. Sneaky snakes. It's a clean box. Yeah, I'm into snakes. the clean. Yeah. Zelda. That's a good one. Come on, don't pass me up. 
<laughs> All right, we gotta throw it in. <laughs> Animal uh, Crossing. Stories? Oh, that's part of the double. Uh, this says no manual. So. Okay. Yeah. Maybe we'll see about we'll see about this stack too. It's not quite as impressive, but there's still some good stuff. I'll let you make sure you get a good look. Hundred. Most of that being in Soul Silvers. Yeah. And I did check your your cartridges to make sure you didn't have any of these. No, I did. I. Yeah, I figured you were on these ones. That's my thing. I'm always trying to fill the box. Yeah. All right. What do you think about about this one? Hundred, and then two fifty. You passing on this stuff too? Is that? I'm passing on that stuff. Yep. And then passing on this stuff as well. You with that? Sick. Thank you so much. All right. This was awesome. Shout out to Lou. He's the man. He's awesome. With the plan. <laughs> um, well, Seth buy, buys games. We're gonna talk about what we got. So, man, empty boxes. They've just they've just had them for a long time. And he says he completes them as they can, but was happy to get them gone. I just made offers, which is really fun to do that at a game store. Three hundred and fifty bucks. Everything here. There's some cool ones now. The condition is definitely not great. I uh, like Bloodlines rough condition, but the manual is in great condition, being stored in there. And some 3D, 3DS boxes that I need, like this one, and this actually has manuals and everything about the system. I'm stoked about that, a couple 2DS ones. I think I need at least one of those, and now I can just get the system loose. It'll make it much easier for the collection. And then there's some really cool ones, like this Star Soldier, Super Godzilla, Breath of Fire, Kirby Superstar, Mega Man Extreme, a bunch of, like there's some Pokemon manuals in there, N64. Ogre Battle 64. That one's in really good manual. shape. That one's pretty good, actually. Then the Soul Silvers, two of those. I think they both have manuals. That's huge. Love that. Um, Pokemon Channel. You know. So what, what's the move on, on selling these guys? Is it a, is it a hold, like investment, that we can I, still add to the Poke Bank? Because we will move them. Yeah, like some of them will be able to complete. Some are going in the collection. Some we might just move as is, you know? and. I think from it all, I'll be able to keep up a few collection pieces, and then with the three games I actually bought, in addition to these, we'll probably be able to get like maybe 200 in the poker bank. All right, so I also grabbed some games and some stuff, which I'm really excited about. First off, we got Mario Golf on a recommendation from both Chase and Sky Guy. So stoked on that. Me and the wife will play it. We got um, Metroid Prime with the bonus disc and the manual, which I didn't even realize it came with the bonus disc. So stoked on that as well. A couple different N64 games here. We've got. Pokemon Stadium, which I thought I had, didn't have. Mario Golf, great label. Yoshi Story, sick, I just love it, awesome. F-Zero, and then of course Bomberman 64. All games, which I didn't have, which I thought I had, and now they're in my collection, so I actually do have them. And I'm actually really stoked to check out this video, even though I was part of it, because, dude, the deals are crazy. You don't have to do that. <laughs> Why not? You really don't have to do that. <laughs> I, I want to do that. Thank you so much, man. Oh my gosh. I was like, I, I got the manual for that. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> You really didn't have to do that, man. Add it to the collection. Yeah, oh, man. Gosh. Thank you so much. I was looking at my other ones. I don't think I got any other ones. <laughs> yeah, that price was right on that. <laughs> so we wrap up at this game store with some great deals, go to another store with Seth, show his viewers what we got when something strange happens. There we are, ripping Pokemon packs, when all of a sudden... So I guess, uh, do you want to go first? I'm ready. Okay. Uh -huh. Me oh, coach. Really not trying to be weird, but what that up? dude showed up with all those Pokemon cards. Oh, no way. Paper. Like, I'm yeah. just, I just wanted to see if you're still over here because, like, it's like a Tupperware full of stuff. And, like, I think they're in there. We should check it out. Yeah. yeah. We're oh, literally yeah. opening like, Pokemon cards as we speak. Like, oh my God, I know. He doesn't even care. <laughs> yeah, we're going to come in. Let's do it. All right. Yeah, Let's we're do coming. It. <laughs> we just went to Plato's Closet with Seth. I got a snapback hat there. Yeah. This is. That'll be on his video. Seth Fowler, check him out. Um, but Lou from the game store just came back and said somebody just showed up with a tub full of Pokemon cards. And he's like, they don't really sell them, but yeah. he's like, I'll buy them if you want to buy them. So I think that's what we're about to walk into right now. <laughs> we're about to take off. Yeah, we were literally like ready to roll and he just came out to check if we were still here. He walked around the entire building to look for <laughs> us. He knew we were going there next. Yeah. So that worked out. Hello. This guy came in with a bunch of Pokemon Nice. Stuff. Nice. I figured you guys, if you wanted, could uh, peek at it because we can't buy it here. Okay, yeah. Give you guys first dibs, especially since I was somehow awkwardly able to catch you over there. <laughs> that worked out. <laughs> I was like, how long is it going to It's creepy to uh, Pokemon cards. I'm like, get over the weirdness of it. Nice. Is this your collection here? 
a lot of childhood cards. Okay. I can't vouch for the quality on most of them. No worries. No worries. You got yeah. nice right there, Flag on the X. That's 2007. That's actually pretty I good. It looks like I got. I think I see another. Too? This is Team Rocket here, which is vintage. There you go. Yeah, Lugia is cool. So what are you looking for when you're sorting through, I guess, vintage bulk, you could say? Shiny. <laughs> <laughs> shiny stuff. Pokemon is simple, man. Look for the shiny. I mean, obviously, condition's not great. It's a childhood collection, right? But I love seeing vintage. Like, this is semi-vintage. Some actual base sets in here. Some Garbage Pail Kids mixed There's in. There's Garbage Pail Kids. This is classic. Oh, E-series stuff, classic. man. Dust Docks. For those that don't know, um, fakes usually just have a very saturation very, is washed out and they're very flimsy. You can tell easier by the back. Like this one is very, very saturated blue. The yellow is almost more orange. And usually the centering on the back is horrendous. Yeah, there's a lot of random. This is crazy. Honestly, this is That's really cool. cool. It's going to be classic. Well, it's a World classic championship collection. card. It's always a s oh energy. energy, energy. So did that come in like a deck, like a World Championship deck? Or? Yes. Okay. Mm. Oh, these are the kind of cards I had. The Delta era is when I started. Mm. All the Delta species. 2006. 2006, seven. Nice. Oh, that is a beautiful card. I love that Rapidash. Yep. So, some of the best cards are these EX ones, uh, but you're right. I mean. Condition definitely matters. That being said, there's still nice ones. That one's got the pen on it. It's classic. Bakugan cards. Oh, there's a Charizard. Those, like, when they came series. out. Series. 2009. GX. Moderate to heavily played. I heavily played. Yeah. <laughs> well, you were just in here, and, like, we were talking about Pokemon, and they yeah. came up, and you literally had a bunch so. of cards, and I was like, I don't want to tell you I can't buy these. <laughs> but, like, I know someone, that if they're still here, that would probably want to at least throw an offer at you. These are, like, if they're, like, near mint, these are, like, probably 30 and 50. These being heavily played would be more like 20-ish, give or take. But it definitely added um, to the overall value. Um, but yeah, totally up to you. You good with it? Sweet, man. That was random and awesome. <laughs> All right, Lou, you're officially the man. Um, these are cool cards, man, like vintage. We just got them for $93, all the cash that we collectively had on us, thank you. Um, <laughs> I'm very excited about it, and it was really nice kind of him to do that, because they're buying all the Pokemon games, amazing stuff, Pokemon Game of Color, all the Pokemon games. That was almost we'll like be back every Pokemon game. Like, yeah. Almost every sequel. But they don't do cards, so he was like, I don't want to tell you no, he wants to take care of his customers. Uh, he said, I know these guys buy them. A hey, quick question. So yeah. we, we talk about the importance of relationships. Is this a relationship where they could buy cards for us? Like maybe we can work out yeah. something with the I mean, manager? It's definitely maybe. something that I want to connect know. with them next time because we'll buy all the Pokemon cards as long as they can get them pretty cheap. Yeah. And these for 93 bucks is a really, really cool score. They're in terrible condition, but... It's classic, man. It's classic childhood cards. <laughs> it's fun, and there are some good cards in here. So regardless, 93 bucks is still a really good buy. It'll take a lot of work piecing them out, but it might be safe. Like a double up. Okay. Maybe 100. Call it clean 100. Cool. So we're at 400 um, in the bank. Yeah, and hopefully I'll keep a few of them too for the collection. So. Let's go. Cool. All right, this is the store we've been waiting for all day. Rocket Comics Toy Store. It's glorious. You guys got to come in and see it. And we have 400 bucks in the Poké Bank that we can potentially spend here. I'm really hoping to make something happen. I was already in there, it was sick. <laughs> <laughs> So Chase, we're looking at cards, but is there anything in particular you're trying to get yeah, for collection I mean, or pre-sale or, or what's your thinking? I'd definitely be targeting collection pieces. I mean, they've got some like Topps Chrome, mm -hmm. which... These I, shiny boys? We don't have them documented yet for me to know which ones we need in the set. We're pretty close. Mm -hmm. So I can't really, but, I mean, they have something crazy over here, the Shadowless Charizard, which... I actually have two Shadowless Charizards. Not at the moment. Yeah, thank you. I actually have two of those now, so yeah, I don't need a third. They're in better shape. I wish it was first edition. Yeah, this one's yeah. in terrible condition. Decent. This is cool. They got the battle figures with Charizard in it. We saw a bunch of these at Southeast. We did. 
It's 50 bucks, which is seems pretty good. They also have some like high-end NES games over here to complete the Castlevania. Simon's Quest 1, 2, and 3? They got them all. Wow. They're 150, 175, which is like decent, but mm -hmm. nothing crazy. Couple, Couple talk cube. boys. Look at that. I know. Credit card, you got it. This store is absolutely beautiful. Like these front display cases are packed with insane stuff. Just high end stuff everywhere. They got games, they got Pokemon cards, they got Legos, they got toys. They got comics, of course, it's in the name, but like just the quality stuff everywhere. Blows my mind every time. And there's new stuff every time too. Everywhere you turn. <laughs> it's just like random ET stuff from the 80s. And to think Hobby Shop Ron store was five times as crazy oh from gosh. everything we've heard. All right, so they do have something pretty special. The Action Replay DSi, the yellow one, for 60 bucks. That's a really good deal. We're gonna, we're gonna buy that. So we did pick up the Action Replay. He actually knocked off 10 bucks on this. Marvel this is gonna do. add like six, well said. This is gonna add 60 bucks to the Pokebank, putting us at 460, but we're gonna dock this. Great deal, 50 bucks with the Charizard. The Pokebank now sits at 410 and we added a beautiful piece to the collection. And we're gonna add it to the collection right now. But in the next videos before the 100,000 special, we're going to massive video game garage sales. So subscribe for it all and help us pass the Detroit Lions so I can give away some crazy stuff. Watch this video, YouTube knows you're gonna like it.